हेलो एवरी वन माई सेल्फ फाइका वाडकर स्टूडेंट ऑफ एफ वाई बी एस सी कंप्यूटर साइंस स्टडिंग इन गोपटे जोगलेकर कॉलेज टूडे आई विल बी टॉकिंग ऑन द टॉपिक आई ट्रैकिंग टेक्नोलॉजी ह्यूमन कंप्यूटर इंटरेक्शन हैज बिकम एन इंक्रीजिंगली इम्पॉर्टेंट पार्ट ऑफ आर डेली लाइफ नाउ इट इज स्मार्टफोन्स एंड टच स्क्रीन यूज फिंगर्स एज इनपुट सोर्स Eye movements are the most frequent of all human movements. Eye movements are fundamental to the operation of visual system. Therefore, the movement of user's eyes can provide a convenient and natural source of input. So, what is eye tracking? The process of using sensors to locate features of the eyes and estimate where someone is looking. How we look our pupils are constantly in motion when the pupil is moving it's called a saccade during a saccade visual perception is unlikely or even impossible the pupil must focus on a point in order to perceive color faces writing etc that is called a fixation fixations are linked to attention moving your eyes means moving attention the red eye effect there's a layer in our eyes that reflects infrared light this is where the red eye effect in photo comes from as photo flashes use infrared light the eye tracking monitor makes use of this effect technology technology relies on infrared illumination most commercial eye tracking systems available today measure point of regard by the corneal reflection or pupil center method these kinds of trackers usually consist of a standard desktop computer with an infrared camera mounted beneath a display monitor with image processing software to locate and identify the features of the eye used for tracking in operation Infrared light from an LED embedded in the infrared camera is first directed into the eye to create strong reflections in target eye. The light enters the retina and a large proportion of it is reflected back, making the pupil appear as a bright, well-defined disk known as the bright pupil effect. The corneal reflection is also generated by the infrared light. appearing as a small but sharp glint the vector between the center of pupil and the location of the corneal reflection is measured and with further trigonometric calculations point of regard can be found calibration calibration is a key factor defining accuracy of any eye tracker before using an eye tracking system it must be calibrated for each use This is usually done by showing a number of calibration points on the screen and asking the user to consecutively fixate at these points one at a time. The relationship between the pupil position and the corneal reflections changes as a function of eye gaze direction. The images of the eye and its orientation are analyzed by the computer for each calibration point each image is associated with corresponding screen coordinates these main points are used to calculate any other point on screen via interpolation of the data the applications of eye tracking technology first active it involves device control for example gaming eye activated login and hands free typing second passive it includes performance analysis of design layout and advertising for example tv commercials street advertising and web advertising let's see the advantages of eye tracking technology eye movement is faster than other current input media No training is required of normal users. Determine where the user's interest is focused automatically. It is helpful for handicapped people where there is no option for hands and speech. 
disadvantages of eye tracking technology can't work with the equipment for example if they wear contact lenses or have long eyelashes calibrating the equipment takes time difficult to control eye position consciously and precisely at all times the equipment is expensive using eye tracking an example there are two versions of an ad design were tested using eye tracking the goal of the ad is to draw attention to the product name let's see the results eye tracking result for version a we see a face effect the model's face draws a lot of attention the slogan is the other hot spot of the design participants will likely have read it the product and its name get some but not a lot of attention result for version b again we see a strong face effect in this version the model's gaze is in the line with the product and its name the product image and name get considerably more attention additionally even the product name at the bottom is noticed by a number of participants thank you for watching hope you liked my video